Okay, the first Barvember problem for 2020. Two boxes A and B contain some buttons. Box A contains four times as many buttons as B. 401 buttons are removed from A. 72 buttons are removed from B. And there are now three times as many buttons in A than B. Okay, right. Now, what I try to do is to approach these problems as if I were a relative novice um, puzzling it out. Now, what I can see here is that I've got two scenarios, okay? One, that's the beginning, and two, this is the situation that we have at the end. And we also, this is the question that we're asked. Okay, and what I might do is start at the beginning because I've got something here that looks easy to draw, perfect bar model material. So we've got A and we've got B. Now, A has four times as many buttons as B, so let's give B one basic unit, okay? And then A would have four times as many, okay? Doesn't matter how badly drawn they are, as long as you recognize what they represent. Okay, so this is the scenario at the beginning. And in order to work this out, I need to figure out how to change it to the scenario at the end where there's three times as many buttons in A than B. And what I know is 401 buttons were removed from A, 72 from B, but I don't know how those compare in size to these units. I can see that um, 401 is not a multiple of 72. Um, so it's very difficult for me to see how I can, you know, alter this in a way that's going to tell me anything. So it doesn't look like starting here is going to be helpful. So I'm then going to go to the end situation, scenario two. Right, here we go. This is two and we've got A and we've got B. Now here a has three times as many buttons than B. Okay, so, so that's going to be one, two, three, and one here. And now, when I started here, I was trying to um, see how I could change scenario one to scenario two in order to puzzle it out. In this situation, I'm going to go backwards in order to puzzle it out. So what have I got? OK, let's start with B. And the reason I'm starting with B is because A is a multiple of B. So B is like my basic unit. So if I want to work backwards, OK, um, what happened to B? So this is what we had at the end but we know that 72 buttons were removed from B. So I'm going to add a portion here that represents 72. That's 72 buttons that were removed from B. Okay, so at the beginning, this is what B had. So, and at, you know, if B had this at the beginning, A had four times this at the beginning. Okay, so that means adding another one of these basic units, because at the moment it's got three times this, so I need to add another one of those. Okay, all right, so that's four times that bit, and now I need to add four of the 72. So one, two, three, four. Okay, so this is four times 72. Okay, so we're really starting to put some numbers in. So now I have got the beginning scenario where A is four times B, but I have numbers in it now. Okay, so this unit is the same as all of these units, 
and these are 72. So what is 4 times 72? Well, that's 288. So I know that this bit is worth 288. Now, this, all of this bit, everything here is what was removed. Yes, so this pink part is what was removed. And what was that? That was 401. Okay. So if this is 401 and this is 288, okay, then 401 subtract 288 must give me the size of one of these units, okay? And that gives me 113, all right? So this is 113, as are all of these others, okay? And what am I being asked, okay? What am I being asked? I'm being asked how many buttons were in box A at the start? So that's all of this, okay? So what have I got here? I know that this bit is 288 and this bit here must be 4 times 113. So 113 times 4, okay, gives me 452, okay. So I know that this bit here, yes, all of that is 452. Two. Okay, so 452 add 228, sorry, 288, 452 add 288 gives 740. Okay, so this, the whole of this is 740 so that's our answer okay okay now you might see in other solutions if you um, you know bought a textbook with um, this question in it you might have the solution presented in a different way okay so what they might do is distribute these all right, throughout the problem. So, for example, so you might have A and you might have B and then you would have, okay, I'm just trying to make, I'll show, this will make sense in a moment, hopefully. Okay. All right, and then, right. Okay. Okay. All right. So, so that's my basic unit plus 72. And there we go. You might see the problem presented like this. Okay. But as you can see, that's just the same thing. All right. It's just this, the same number of these basic units plus the 72. Okay, right. First problem down. I hope that helped.